Hey guys, welcome back to my vlog channel. Um, it's been a minute since I filmed in the car. It is, oh, my watch is about to die. It is 4.22 on Sunday the 14th of April. Wow, it's already the 14th. I feel like, oh jeez, you're bouncing all over the place. I feel like time is going so fast lately. Like I, I feel like it's still March. It's the middle of April. I didn't even realize. Um, but anyway, I thought that I would tell you guys about my weekend. Um, I'm back in town now. I'm actually close to my apartment, but I'm going to keep driving to Meyer because there's a couple things I want to get from the store um, that I want for tomorrow. I want to get some cold brew coffee. I don't know if you guys know about that. That I mean, I know most people have like you know, a coffee pot or whatever, and they make their own coffee, but I've just been buying the bottles of cold brew that they have at Meijer, um, and I'm out, because all last week, I had my coffee at home, I have not went out for coffee in a week, because I've just, I know how much money it costs, and I just didn't really care, because I liked to go, but the last week or so, I got it at the store, and I was like, let me just see, you know, let me adjust, I can drink my coffee at home. restaurant that's in our town um, and it was really good I got um, a salad I always get a blackened chicken salad from this place sorry my blinkers gonna be on for a long time um, I got a blackened chicken salad we got breadsticks I think they both got a pizza I think they both got yeah like a personal pizza Hello. Just texting on her phone, not paying attention. I'm trying to turn left here. Um, so, yeah, it was good. And then I got home and my aunt came in because my aunt actually lives in Colorado. Um, but she does, she's lived in Michigan my whole life up until the last couple years. So she's able to do her work that she always has done in Michigan and she just does it remotely from Colorado but she'll come back every few months or maybe weeks I'm not sure how often but she comes back to do stuff in office and then when she's home in Colorado she does stuff um remotely or whatever so it was good seeing her um we sat around the fire pit for a little bit had drinks just chatted um yeah it was really nice to be home with everybody and then this morning, went up, or got up and went for a run. Um, I ran and my mom rode bike with me because I've talked about this before. I don't ever go run by myself. I don't go run alone. Um, so yeah, she went with me, bless her. And I don't know if any of you guys 
guys run. Oh, you can see I've got all my crap in the back. I've got my hamper. <laughs> um, I don't know if any of you guys run. I'm sure a lot of people run alone. I always, like I said, I don't go by myself ever, but I'm usually running with someone, like someone else is also running with me. And I was talking to my brother when I got done with my run. I was like, it's so much harder for me to run by myself because like knowing, like misery loves company. Like knowing that someone else is running next to me and knowing that they're also struggling, like fuels me. Like I'm like, okay, like we're in this together, we're doing it together. Cause I was running today and my mom was with me, but she was riding bike and she was on our electric bike. So it's not like she was working hard, you know, like it's all you have to do is, you know, hold the throttle or pedal, but it's very assisted. So it's not hard work at all. And I was just like, oh, like this is so hard. And I know that she's just like back there pedaling. <laughs> it's like, I want to stop. But so yeah, let me know if you, any of you that run relate, if you think it's easier or harder to run alone versus with other people. I definitely notice the difference anytime running alone because it's like, I could just quit. Like I could literally just walk. I like have the war with myself inside. But when I'm with someone, it's like, you know, we're doing it together. We're keeping each other accountable. I don't know. Let me know if anybody relates. Um, but yeah, so left there probably at two. Like I said, it's 4.30 right now. Um, sorry, my eyes are just killing me. I talked about this in my last vlog or maybe the one before that. But my eyes lately, it's just like constant itching constantly just like my contacts are drying up I don't know what's going on with them but it's really it just has been driving me nuts um but I'm about to pull into Meyer here in a couple seconds and I'll probably hop back on and talk to you guys on my way home um and maybe I'll tell you what I got because I might get I'm gonna look around a little bit I'm not in any sort of rush I got back early today so oh I got it I already said this, my watch is about to die, but I'm at 9%. I've been wearing it for like over 24 hours. I put it on yesterday morning when I woke up and I don't usually bring my Apple Watch charger with me. So I just wore it all night long and it's still charged. That's pretty impressive. My phone would have been dead like two times over by now. But all right, I'm pulling in right now. Um, I'll jump back on in just a sec. All right, leaving Meyer now. I did not stray from the list, I don't think. Um, I just got bananas, coffee, lip gloss, found the lip liner, and I got a couple of these little protein drinks that I've been liking. Um, and now I'm heading home, but I am hot. I don't have the AC on really because I didn't want it to be super loud, like blasting by the camera, you know? Um, so maybe I should open my windows a little bit. It'll probably be loud. Just a little. I, get... I hate that the windows, when they don't stop, when you take your finger off, when it's like automatic and they keep going. Oh, I gotta blast through this light. Uh -oh. My bags are rolling around back there, probably spilling. It's fine though. It's such a beautiful day though. That's what the point I was trying to make by saying it's hot in the car. It's so beautiful. It's like 70 degrees out in April, the middle of April. How lucky. Um, everyone in the store was in like t-shirts and shorts, flip-flops. I was like, all right. I have leggings on, but I've got this tank top on, so I was good too. Um, it wasn't too hot. It's always a little bit cold for me and Meyer, so I usually don't, yeah. The window's gotta go if that's too loud. Um, I usually don't, I usually will like wear a sweater or something. I wouldn't go in just like shorts and a tank top usually because she cold cold in there um, but I'm on my way home now I'm sweating a little bit now that whew, I'm back in the car but um, I'm probably going to sit on my porch a little bit I've got some Cayman Jacks in the fridge calling my name if you guys don't know what those are they're margaritas and they're really really good if you're a margarita person and you haven't tried Cayman Jacks I assume you can get them at Walmart I get them at Meijer um, they have them at a lot of gas stations. You should check them out. They're really, really good. It's like a margarita, but it's also carbonated. So it's like a margarita pop. It's delicious. Um, so I'm going to sit outside. 
just a little bit or maybe I'll wait a little bit because I don't want to get too much sun but it'll be warm for a while yet tonight um, so maybe I'll watch a little bit of TV and then I'll go out but I want to go out there and read have a drink that's my plan just relax the rest of the night um, I do need to put my laundry away that I've got in the back but I only did one load so it was not a lot of stuff um, I don't know if I've ever mentioned that that I take my laundry home to do at my parents house when I go you guys um, my whole building has two washing machines and two dryers and they're like in the basement so I don't like going down there by myself it just feels like I'm gonna get kidnapped down there I never do my laundry there um, and they also malfunction a lot so like I'll pay for it and it won't run or you know whatever so I just don't even bother I did the first month or so when I lived there and I was like nah like I hate the feeling of going down there is like I'm walking to my death like I'm like I'm gonna get trapped down here somehow like it, it's just you like have to go around a corner and they're like in a dark dank cellar like no I don't like I don't like to go down there um, so in my next apartment which is a good thing for me to keep in mind because that wasn't one of the things I cared about at this place. Um, at my next place, I do need somewhere with a washer and dryer because taking it home, lugging it around, taking this up the steps to my apartment is like the bane of my existence every other week. <laughs> I hate it. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna do that. I really wanna watch Safe Haven. I don't know if I said that in my last video, but it's been on my mind for like a week. I really want to watch that movie and I saw that it's streaming somewhere the other day and you don't have to rent it so I'm like oh I need to watch this while it's free um, because I love that movie and I love Juliet Hoff I don't know if you guys I mean I don't think she's like a super big actress um, but I assume most of you probably know who she is I love her she's so pretty I used to want to look exactly like Juliet Hoff when I was young um, so I want to watch that and just chill. I'm gonna have leftovers for my dinner. I'm gonna have what I talked about in my last vlog, the leftovers of, cause I made that on Friday, Thursday, but it's just taco meat is what's left and I made pico and then I just have to like make some tater tots, put the taco meat on it, you know, lettuce, pico, cheese. And it was really good. Um, somebody said they wanted an update, so it was delicious. It wasn't as good as the restaurant, which I thought it would be. I was like, I have everything. Like, it's gonna be spot on replication. It wasn't, it was still pretty good though. Um, so yeah, I would make it again. I would eat it again. I'm gonna eat it tonight. Um, but anyways, I'm almost home. So I'll talk to you guys later. Like I said, let me know what you guys did this weekend. Um, anything you wanna chat to me about, put it down in the comments. Um, thanks for hanging out and I'll see you guys next time.